Alright, hello audience. Um, wow, this is lagging hard. Um, that's why. Let's turn it down to just a render under the normal distance. Today, we are going to be looking at the particle accelerator in volts. Yes, you heard right, volts. So, I'm going to actually turn this to Creative Plus, which is kind of nice. Uh, you cannot build this block in um, cre er, non-creative. It's just convenient. It just does that. It builds your hydron collider for you. Um, yeah, it just makes it so much easier to deal with. Okay, let's put our particle accelerator. And they do look exactly the same. Alright, and you must make sure your particle accelerator is in one of the corners, so right here. Um, I'm doing this while the Super Bowl is paused. Uh, they have a blackout in uh, half of the stadium. <laughs> Some people are probably thinking the... Uh, San Francisco uh, d paid someone to turn off the um, lights. Now, what do I want to do? Look up some wire. Um, insulated. Let me want superconductor. Super conductor. Let's just do this. And then hook that up to power and because I'm green I am feeling good today I'm just going to use solar panels why do I keep on doing that solar panel and this is just going to be basic you'd normally want failing solar uh, you would normally want battery boxes and all sorts of stuff to keep this running whoops that was wrong two three oh. ah. just gotta break the stupid snow one two three so that's just gonna f expand over here And I'm going to expand it one more just for the heck of it. Hmm. Actually, I grab a piece of dirt. Oh, um, for some reason the Super Bowl commercials haven't been doing. Or haven't actually seemed that nice this year. Of course, I'm probably the only person that, will, that watches the Super Bowl goal, ju Super Bowl just for the commercials. <laughs> ah, gets so annoying with these giant solar panels. They are absolutely humongo. Oh, break the snow. Gotta break the snow. That's a glitch. You can just go through, straight through the wire. When you jump and walk backwards. Let's try that again. Oh. That's weird. It only works one way. Maybe. Maybe I'm just not jumping high enough because of these stupid solar panels. Um. Let's see, how am I going to get around this? To get down to my. Precious particle accelerator. 
Uh, it's still lagging pretty badly. Um, I'm only getting. There we go. Back up to 30 FPS. So much better. Alright, let's get a switch or level lever. There we go. Wait, I don't want to do that yet. Let's plop some dirt in there. And then tube, maybe? No. And what are they called? Uh, forget what the stupid holders are called. Uh, did I just skip it? Mm, no, we didn't. So, that's what I want. Alright. This is pretty loud. But you can... See the particle going now. This will just go around and around and around and around and faster and faster and until I can't even catch up to it because I'm flying too slowly. And around. Come on. There we go. There he is. And you only hear the noise when you go, ah, I'm off track. Must catch up. Where is it? Have I beaten it already? No, it's gone around already, so I'll have to wait for it. There it is. Must catch up to part of... Oh, yeah, it's going way too fast now. But anyway, it will go around a few times. But pretty much the bigger you make your particle colliders, the faster they work, the more power efficient they are, and the more actual stuff you will get out of them. So, that's just the basic setup. And these are used for antimatter explosives, which is, um, I will touch upon in this episode, but I will have another episode with missiles and other explosives. So when this holds and maintains 100% velocity, oh, and you also need a, there we go, Oh, what? I guess you only sometimes get any matter, unless that's a glitch that you need it facing a certain direction. Hmm. Whatever. Let's just set up a missile. There. Launch. Sure. Boom, boom. This is just the highest tier launcher. Break. Come on. Why doesn't this work? Ah. Uh, And if you didn't notice, there is a sl there is like an inventory that if you just click on it, but when you just click on it with a missile, you don't even it doesn't even open the inventory. It just automatically places the missile. I will show you that in one second when I place a missile when this. We'll finish charging up. Mm. Alright, antimatter missile. See, you just click and it automatically places. This thing is absolutely gigantic. So, let's, uh, oh wow. Why isn't this. Why you no work? I'm gonna finish charging.
I still have not. Maybe I need it to face a certain way. There, it should be charged now. I do not know why that's not working, but it should produce any matter. Um, let's put this at zero. I hope that's right. I'll probably just go that way. But, whatever. And if the fog wasn't on, we'd see it coming. Oh, snap. And, yeah. That's what it does. So, if you're on a server and someone has one of these, please don't mess with them. Because, you know, uh, Rithian's castle that uh, Duncan has a nuke under, that thing is like this tiny little crappy explosion compared to this. Oh, and you know, want to know something that's even worse? Check this out. Red matter missile. Whoops. Uh, let's go. Insufficient e electricity for some reason. It hates me. Ah, this is so annoying. Um, let's just break that for a second. This needs like its own solar panel. All right. And it should come down in a 30 block radius of this. But pretty much this just sucks anything into it. So as I will demonstrate now by committing suicide and turning the sound down, this thing is loud. There. That's pretty much what it does. It will suck you in. And now I cannot respawn peacefully. But yeah, I'll get sucked in here in a moment. See, I'm still moving kind of towards it. But yeah, it'll suck me in in a second. Whoa. I'm gonna go this next round when this ice gets sucked up. But yeah, blocks just fly everywhere. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. I'm just being dropped up and down. This is unfair, stupid explosive. Look at this. I'm just bouncing. Whoa. Whoa, not cool. That was weird. Oh, now I'm just gonna bounce again. I don't know. Well, anyway, let's go over this way. Oh, wow. There's a Gangnam Style pistachio commercial going on right now. That's just sad. Yes, I'm actually watching TV as I am playing Minecraft. Multitasking for the win. Alright, well, anyway. There is some other type of explosive. Um, ah, hyper explosive. Let me just do explosive. Hypersonic explosives. Oh, this probably won't be just the ten minutes long because I do not have a timer to tell me how long it is. Alright, let's set this off with a lever. 
with a lever. Oh god. It's going. It is going. Oh god. Whoa. There's gonna be blocks all over the freaking place. Alright. Before you guys go, I'm going to do something. Which is this. I hope you guys enjoy. Because I think my computer's going to blow up. Oh. I turn it back to noon. <sighs> this is gonna hurt. Say bye bye to my new gaming computer. Um. Mm. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. That wasn't that bad. Besides, there is another type of explosive sitting here, which I must try. Oh, that's weird. I kind of ah, who cares? Oh, I did not place that there. I swear, I did not. That was rather worthless. It's quite stupid. Right. Oh, wow. There. I'm just going to ruin the landscape. Because I'm awesome that way. I wonder if it'll pull bed pull and push bedrock. I'm gonna try something. Bye bye. I get smashed by a falling block. Wow. Oh wow, this stupid bomb is still going off. That is really loud. So you really don't want to mess with the Nova bombs. Come on. Um, create a. There we go. Thank God. Yeah, don't rest mess with the red bat. Uh, red matter bombs. Hey, we made the landscape look a lot nicer now. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed. Rate, comment, subscribe, etc. And is this thing still accelerating? Yes, it is somehow still still actually working. Considering our amount of failness. Ah, let me out. There we go. Let me just check if this thing's worked. You may have to play around with the, your positioning of the particle accelerator. Oh, it's giving us some antimatter. So, I'm just kidding. You don't need to play around with that. But once you get five of these, you can make one gram of antimatter, which takes five to make um, an antimatter explosive. Or, no. It takes five of these to make one gram. And then it takes eight grams. So, twenty, or forty of these, my bad, math fail, um, to make one antimatter explosive. And you use, like, one antimatter explosive per antimatter missile, or maybe it's more. I don't know. But anyway, guys, bye. Hope you enjoyed explosion-ness. I can't believe my computer can take this. Alright, bye, guys. Oh, if you look up at, at the right, you can see Ray's mini-map on how it's progressing and taking the blocks, how it's going over. Well, anyway, guys, bye.